Thank you very much, fellow Kenyans. I want to take this opportunity to once again address comrades and the student leaders from various universities. There is the new funding model that is really uh, a pain, that is really transferring the burden of cost on the shoulders of our parents, our comrades, and therefore so many of our comrades are not going to get access to education. We are aware that as of today, over 70,000 students are not going to join universities from August because they are missing on the new, they are missing on the scholarships because of the new funding model. Imagine 70,000 students, our children, from poor backgrounds, from villages, from various slums in this country are not going to go to school and yet it is only education that a student should access. The only source of hope that a student has, that a child has, is education, which is the best and the most important tool for fighting poverty. And that tool is being denied to this student. And we also know that Ruto is Ruto today. He's a president today because of education. Why not for education? He would be selling chicken back in Sugoi. Why not for education? He would never have come to Nairobi. Why not for education? He would have never made it to State House. So therefore, student leaders, tomorrow as you meet the principal secretary for education, Madam Beatrice, ensure that the new funding model is dropped tomorrow. Ensure that you don't leave that hostel, that, that hall where you'll be holding your meeting at the Kenya School of Government. Ensure that tomorrow will be the day that the new funding model will never be heard of again. The new funding model is really restricting our students from getting education, our children, our brothers and sisters, our Gen Z's from getting access to education. And therefore, Ruto must rescind his, his, his decision on the new funding model. We want the old funding model where the help is available for our comrades. They are being financed to study, then they will pay later on. But this new funding model where a student must pass, part with 300,000 Kenya shillings to get the least cost, which is an art course, and a medical course, which is 600,000 Kenya shillings, in four years, a student, a parent, has, has, must part with 1.2 million Kenya shillings. A parent who is selling boga, who is selling omena, who is riding a boda boda, who is going from Django, who can't even, who has never seen 20,000 shillings at once, has never held 20,000 shillings at one in his or her hands. You want to subject this parent to pay 300,000 Kenya shillings in a year, 1.2 million Kenya shillings in four years, honestly speaking, and this parent has other costs, to take care of, has rent to pay, has other, has, has, has other fees to pay for other children. This parent has other costs to take care of. We cannot accept that. So tomorrow, comrades, student leaders, do not disappoint this nation. Do not, do not disappoint your constituents who are your students. Tomorrow, fight this thing once and for all. Do not agree and don't limit it. You can hold demonstrations in every university in this country and every college in this country. And the country must be paralyzed. If at all, the Ruto is still going to proceed with this new funding model. Thank you and God bless you all.